Hey guys, and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included with me, Townsend. How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I hope you're doing pretty good. If you guys like today's episode, please like and share as you see fit. If you haven't already, please subscribe. So, as you guys can see right here on the middle, there has been a new patch released. Uh, this is... what is this one? Uh, the autom Automation Upgrade. Uh, new buildings base automation is including sensors, switches, logic, logic gates, and duplicate checkpoints, which sounds pretty cool. Automation inputs for existing buildings and new automobile... Uh, uh, system shutoffs, uh, what else? Two new ore processing buildings, two metal refinements, revamped tech tree with new research tiers, buildings and overlays, and bug fixes and performance to improvements. So with the new patch coming out, that means we've got to start over. <laughs> it's, which uh, isn't that bad. Uh, I did do a recording of Auction Not Included not too long ago, after the last one that I put up, and when I went to edit it, uh, there was no sound. Uh, OBS decided to be a pain in my butt that day and <laughs> so uh, I had gotten pretty far ahead and uh, with no audio it was kind of ruined right and then bringing you guys in would be kind of you know um, a shock I guess to see what we had completed and then you know what I mean so it's just best that we start over the next patch is in three weeks uh, six days and so it is what it is it's perfect I like what they're doing here though Every time they add something, they add something to this uh, picture, right? Like all this uh, wiring here and th these parts here. So let's go a new game, standard game, custom. No, I'm not going to do it. Start game. We got to check out our dupes right off the bat. All right. So let's see. Vomiter, ugly crier. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to start this way and go this way, right? Obviously. So we're going to look for only ugly criers right off the bat. Ugly crier, eight to creativity, five to digging, one. Squeamish, uh, cannot perform job aid. Okay, the, yeah. Uh, actually, the decor expectations a little high, anyways. The aid is, uh, there we go. Um, what would you say, uh, first aid. 10 to immunity, 7 to medicine, 2 to creativity. Alright, let's go to the next one. He was an ugly crier to start with, too, which kind of sucks because you can't go backwards, right? Right, let's just keep going. Ugly Crier, two, the, two, five, and seven. Buff, Yokel. I think can yeah, I can't do research as in, I can't do research. Vomiter, eight to construction, yada, yada, yada. Ugly Crier, five, six, two, and one. Uh, we need somebody that can actually do research. And there we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah, Gastrophobia, can't cook. Works for me. Embark. <laughs> so, right off the bat. Yeah. Pause the game. Let's zoom out. So we have a little bit of water at the top here. Uh, actually, that's a nice. That's a nice uh, void altogether. Should just build a ladder from here straight down. Drop all that water down into there. That's probably what we'll do, actually. And then just, this is nice, too. Lots of algae, copper, all in the same area and move upwards all right so we all know how this starts so i'll get us a couple cycles in and i will bring you guys back oh wait no actually yeah we got to get the research going anyways right because you guys can see automation i didn't even click on it yet so yeah we'll get everything going and then uh i'll bring you guys back all right so we just got the research going uh sorry <laughs> pause this for a second not much but like uh we've gotten the base kind of set up I, like i said i built the ladder up here we uh Took all this water, drained it down into this pit now, which is great. Uh, it's all sitting in one spot. We can work off of that, right? Uh, are we, we got the research up and running. Or, sorry, <laughs> the bed's up here. Uh, exactly how I'd like to have it. We have storage here. And on this side, we'll probably put the food. Obviously, below this, we'll put uh, meal wood and stuff like that. But either way, let's go into research. And as you guys can see, it's gotten a lot bigger. They've added another tier here. So what is this? Valve miniaturization? Smaller, more efficient pumps for those low th what? throughput situations. Draws in a small amount of gas, runs it through pipes. And mini liquid pump draws in a small amount of water, liquid, and runs it through pipes. Not 100% sure there. Uh, d duplicate checkpoint, okay. And then there's filter gates. What's this? Be uh, an end gate becomes an active when symptoms... Connected to the input. Okay, there's a bunch of these. Not gate, buffer gate, or gate. 
XOR gate. <laughs> so there's a bunch of stuff there. Um, oil well, polymer press. I think these we've already seen. No, it says metal refinery. Uh, okay. And then metal tile used as a floor tile build. Significantly increases duplicate run speed. Okay. We never got to use those in the last one either. The plastic apparently did that too. So we're just going to have to look at these slowly but surely. Uh, duplicate checkpoint. Yeah. Uh, we'll just have to check everything out as it goes along, but as per usual, we'll start with our original and keep going. So, uh, what it looks like so far is we got a slime biome up here, slime biome over here, and slime biome over here, which is kind of nice, actually. I'm not going to say great. Um, let's take a look at the temperatures, because the temperatures are really going to tell the story. We are encircled by warmth. I'm not happy with that. That means that it's going to be kind of a pain in the butt to keep this cool. We're going to be having to probably pump in cold air. Why did they do that? Come on, dupes. Hurry up. <laughs> See, look at them. So well behaved. But alright, I'm going to get some research done. I'm going to get... Uh, probably, we'll see what the new next duplicate's all about. And uh, we'll get a little bit further into the game here. A little more research done. Alright, you guys. So I have to do an experiment here. <laughs> I just noticed that you can build multiple re research stations. And I was thinking, can we research the same thing twice as fast? Or can we research multiple things at once, right? So what I'm going to do is go click here. Because we just finished the research for basic farming. So we're going to go to... Advanced research, uh, supercomputer intermediate research point allows advanced technology tiers to be advanced. Okay, let's go like that. Click there, for that one. And then for this one, it's the same thing. Okay, so that's fine. We will allow that to happen. Let's go like this and see if maybe they double up. If, if only one dupe goes to the research, then it's, you know, it's... It's only pointless that, to have one, right? No, they both do. Wow, okay, so you can speed up. Uh, destructive, vomiter, and destructive. Let's take the vomiter. We need people, so let's go like this. That's awesome, though, that you can do this. Uh, we'll probably do that for all of them really quickly, so we can just, you know, knock them out of the park. I'll probably build the supercomputer, too, and then we'll have all three. Well, like, we'll have these two plus the supercomputer, and uh, we'll see how that goes. But, let's get another cot built here. Because we need to start getting these guys. Uh, the oxygen is not too nice there. Alright, what we need to do is go... Like so, I think. And there. And then, what I want to do is we'll have to <laughs> build over here and... Bust a hole. Well, I guess we could kind of go like that. Wow, that was fast. I know it's just the very first tier, but let's do it. Alright, so everything's going along half decently right now. <laughs> Other than, once again, I didn't pay attention, and there's a lot of carbon or CO2 <laughs> built up in the base here, which. I guess isn't the worst thing in the world that we can deal with it. We are dealing with it. Uh, it's just... Oops, uh, everybody's doing stuff. Perfect. So I got the very first harvest off before we ran out of food. Which I'm happy about that for. Problem being though is... Oh, we didn't get it. They're all, we need the, the fridge in order for us to store it, right? So <laughs> it's going to be kind of a pain in the butt that way. Uh, but they are on their way to it. Why is there still polluted dirt in here? There's not... Okay. Sweep that. It needs to go down here. Oh, we don't have the compost ready. We have... Uh, I'm looking for a manual airlock, too. Uh, but yeah, we do have them researching everything, slowly but surely. The, the funny thing is, though, is that we have uh, two for the basic uh, research going. And it looks like you, you can see that they're both there, right? But uh, the moment that it stops, it just they don't have anything to do with this side, right? So it'd almost be nicer to have... Well, it would be nice to have two supercomputers... Maybe I should. No, let's uh, let's do that. Let's do the opposite. Get that demolished, and then we'll put another supercomputer there. Hopefully, 
If not, we'll just put it further down. Uh, stations. Yeah, we're gonna have to put it there. Now they have done some artwork upgrade or updates too. As you guys can see there with the wires, it's a little bit different. And then even when they're going through the ground, they look a little bit different. So there's a bunch of new stuff, obviously. <laughs> but I haven't gotten any of these stations yet, so it's gonna take us a while to get there, I have a feeling. But uh, yeah, like we're starting off, we're, everything's going half decently, right? Like it's, it, we've we've had worse starts, way, way, way worse starts before. <laughs> so I'm just trying to check out everything. Obviously we do need to go and uh, check out what everything else is, or what everything else looks like around here, but uh, uh, we'll see. We'll get the super computer going and then, um, I don't know. We'll see if it actually speeds up the the research it should on the like the top end because it's the more advanced or the advanced part of the research that takes longer right um the novice research isn't that bad they get it they get it over and done with fairly quickly uh, only thing that i'm worried about is that uh yeah they're not they're not completing certain tasks like this sweep should have been done either way uh, Compost, yeah, they still haven't worked on that. Blah, blah, blah. All the usual stuff, right? This is kind of annoying, though. <laughs> uh, not that it's... Like, it's a cool idea that they put in here, and I understand it. But I completely forgot that we had to put this in here, so I made that supercomputer up here. And I was like, all right, come on, let's let's get, let's get going here. And they were just, like, walking around. I was like, why aren't you getting the water? <laughs> and it's because I didn't put the pitcher pump in. Uh, also, with the polluted water here, we're going to have to get rid of that, too. That's why... As soon as we get an airlock, I can put it here. We can walk out into this area and start throwing our polluted water in to this area and hopefully find something, you know, natural gas geyser, water geyser. Uh, it doesn't really matter to me, either or. Uh, okay, well, what's next? So we got the fridge. Uh, we need there. Okay, so food, refrigerator. Uh, we'll just put the one for the moment. Power. Unfortunately, we're going to have to connect everything now. Because just this this wheel, yeah, you can see how quickly it's drained, right? So, <laughs> all in all, we're going to have to uh, take it all. How's the oxygen doing? Ugh. Do we not have... Yeah, we still don't have the... <laughs> uh, what is it? The copper floor pipes or plates. I can't remember what they're called now. Uh, where are they? Right here. Airflow tile. There we go. <laughs> Would not have thought I'd forget those ones, but... Uh, come on. So even though, the, even though there's no power to the fridge, they were putting food in the fridge... Now, perfect. See, we ran out of rations. We got the fridge up and running just in time. So yeah, just jump on the meal lice uh, board right away and start planting stuff. Let's take a look at the dupes. I don't think there's gonna ugly crier, binge eater, ugly crier. Okay, maybe we might have to take a look at these guys. Non-constructive yokel, gastrophobic, bottomless pit, non-construction. Athlete, see, doesn't really matter. Athle athletics and learning is really good. Uh, can't build, that's fine. Let's grab this guy. Print. <laughs> uh, we're gonna have to make him a bed. Food shortage? No, there's not. There's a full fridge. Oh, you know what? But I bet you it probably will be getting close to that. Furniture. Pot. Everything else looks all right at the moment. Go like this though, food. Because this whole floor is eventually going to turn into a giant farm. So that's, we'll get these going and then we'll dig up all these and we'll slowly replace, replace them with all these tile. Uh, no seed, no liquid intake. Yeah, I know. Um... <laughs> There's a lot of stuff we got to get going here. Kind of wish that, you know. There was two of them here. 
Do I really need to go two and two? Man, that would really be a drain, wouldn't it? Let's just take a look here. Yeah, so they don't jump ahead. Okay, so... Uh, Alright, we'll tell them to do it. We'll see what happens here. Either way, it doesn't... It matters. I know it's at the very beginning of the game. But at the exact same time, it's like... You, the sooner you can get the research over and done with, the sooner, you know, you can actually start focusing on other stuff. You know, building your base out the way you want it to and stuff like that. Like, because where are all these... The research uh, stations are, I'm going to turn into massage tables, right? So, massage tables, med bay, all that stuff. Um, yeah, obviously I have one too many dupes. Which, right now, doesn't really matter. Uh, you don't want to overstress them, right? And as long as we have, you know, one or two of them just walking around doing nothing, that's not the end of the world, once again. <laughs> Alright, so we just got everything there. Oh, we got the mesh tile. Oh, did we... Are we researching the wrong one? No, we're going for the... Mechanized door. Uh-oh, I think I did. Oh, which one did we miss? Right here. This is what I wanted. Uh... Let's go this way. <laughs> Man, we made a huge mistake on that one. It's like a madhouse in here, and unfortunately... The garden didn't work out. <laughs> we still ran short on uh, food, but we do have the uh, food safety. I'm going to manage food contamination. Oh, okay. Uh, but either way, it's not gonna. we're not going to have to run the micro musher for too long, uh, but I've also been thinking about the farm here. So what I should do is right here, uh, build in the bathroom, the shower, and all that stuff, right? And then we were going to run the polluted water this way. And then we can loop it back if we need to. Or we can just run it straight through and on into this uh, slime biome. Uh, one way or another. But like then we can at least get rid of the polluted water. Or we can bring in polluted water from this side and bring it out that way. Ooh. Automation. Uh, Altmo sensor becomes active. Yeah, okay. We've already had this before. Alright. So I think that's probably a good start to the, <laughs> to the new uh, world, I guess, colony. Um, the CO2 is still an issue, which is weird because this has been going pretty good well. Um, you know, I, th I thought that I had it in the right spot. That You know, I thought air would rise up and all the CO2 would drop, but it doesn't seem to be doing that. So we're going to have to figure that out in the next episode. But that's going to do it for this episode, you guys. So if you guys like the episode, please leave a like, leave a comment. If you haven't already, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.